Manchester City have started very, very brightly, as perhaps we expected, but Hannah Hampton called into action. She was equal to it, but warning signs really for Birmingham. Here with the shot, it's uh, spilled by Hampton and following up it is Chloe Kelly and Manchester City have found a way through with inside the first 10 minutes. Nothing Hannah Hampton could do, she could only parry it into the path of Chloe Kelly and Manchester City are up and running. Stanway's turn to pull into a central position and try and pull the strings and they've released Hemp and Hemp has White lurking on the edge of the six yard area. Kelly's there as well and that's the second goal for Chloe Kelly in the right place at the right time, and Manchester City have doubled their advantage. When they get into them positions down the line and, you know, they're in crossing positions or pullback positions, they've got so many players filling the box and so many, so much support and so many options. It's so important that you've got to track your runner. Kelly in behind. She's on a hat-trick. Chloe Kelly thinking about going alone. She goes to ground. Is that a penalty? The referee says yes. She looks like she's in... Serious pain here, Chloe Kelly. Her afternoon ends prematurely. And it's a chance for the home side to go three goals to the good. It is a Weir, and it's saved by Hampton. Here's Walsh. Weir, Weir, looking to make amends. Another save by Hampton. Stanway. Stands the ball up. And it's going to be Weir with the shot and Hampton with the save. Not dealt with, and there's an opportunity, and this one has found a way through, and Manchester City have got a third. Hannah Hampton has been beaten in this second half, and Manchester City will be home and dry now. They lead by three goals to nil. Greenwood up from the back. It's ricocheted into the net. And Manchester City have scored deep in stoppage time. Manchester City have done their bit. They've beaten Birmingham by four goals to nil.